Hi there everyone, this is Hitesh and I'm back with another video or a video series out there. So every day I get plethora of emails asking about how can I learn programming? What are the prerequisites to learn programming? Which laptop should I buy to learn programming? Or which language would be suitable for Android development or iOS development or a tons of questions like that. In this entire series, we are going to answer a lot about them. So let's get started out here. So far, I haven't seen a single day when somebody's email doesn't pop up at my screen saying, how can I learn programming? How can I learn programming for iOS or which language to choose in order to design for an Android app or something like that? There is a lot of question. And, I, and of course, you can see in the comment section out there, people ask a lot about the laptops, which laptop to buy, which PC to buy and lots of things like that. So I thought that it would be really, really great to create an online resource about programming. Yes, that's all about it. And if you'll ask any programmer out there who has a little bit experience, maybe five years or six years, he's going to say you the same thing, that programming is a generalized concept and language specific concept is a different thing. In all of the languages, whether it's C, C Sharp, C++, Python, Swift, PHP, anything out there, the core foundation of programming always remains the same. Yes, the syntax does really change, but most of the foundation always remains same. Look around there, the loops, the function, the variable, the constant, in fact, everything remains always the same. The syntax, of course, does change a little bit, like var, the constants, the let keyword, and all of that. So what we are gonna do in this series, so this is just an introduction movie out there. So what we are going to do in this series is really simple. We're going to first focus on the programming. What is programming? How you can learn it? Who can learn it? What are the prerequisites to learn about it? How much time you need to give every single day to learn programming? How much consistency you need to learn programming? Which language should you choose in order to specifically develop for your favorite platform? What is the requirement for game design, game development, iOS development, web development? Ah, oh, I know, a tons of questions are out there. And further, we'll move on to uh, choosing the best machine for the starters, for the pros and things like that. So it's going to be a little bit tricky because you might be asking, hey, since you're going to teach what is programming and what are functions and what are loops, which language are going to you choose? And here's the surprise. I'm not going to be choosing any language out there. I'll be discussing the generalized concept that will help you to understand the programming in much deeper manner than just focusing on the syntax. In every specific video, I'm going to be talking about the loops or the functions, or let's just say any specific topic. Then I'll show you what basically it is and what are the syntax out there that you can choose around. This is going to be one unique and a fun series out there. I hope you are also very excited for this series. And in case you have some small cousins out there, the junior cousins, or maybe some, uh, some guys out there who want to really learn programming, who can get benefit from this programming, make sure that you share this video with them because I'm going to be coming up with a full fledged series, fully on the YouTube, fully free that you can really uh, get help out there. I would like to call this series as Hello World out there because we're going to discuss that in one of the movie. So let's just get started with the Hello World programming series. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, do hit the subscribe button. I'm creating a lot of fantastic and awesome content out there on this channel. In case you liked the video, do hit the like button. In case you didn't like it, do hit the dislike button. So see you out there in the next movie where we are going to first discuss about programming.